I know that the role that I have uh, is primarily viewed as one of caretaker. A new Premier will be selected uh, for Manitobans in 60 days. But I also know that uh, these are times that will still require significant decisions. And I will rely upon my PC caucus colleagues, a great team of women and men, to assist in these decisions. As it is a caretaker role, Cabinet will continue on in its current composition for a new Premier to make longer-term de decisions about uh, the Cabinet when they assume office. However, at this point, uh, I have asked my friend and colleague, Minister Rochelle Squires, to serve as the Deputy Premier, and I'm honoured that she has accepted that offer. You will also know that the legislature is currently on recess. There are five bills that have been held over and they are scheduled for uh, a vote. There's also been hundreds of presenters uh, that have registered in our very unique process in Manitoba where the public can come and give presentation directly to uh, the lawmakers, to the legislators. That's a great, great process and I want to thank all of those individuals who signed up to have their voices heard on those five bills in particular. However, I also know that a new leader has to be able to set their own agenda. As such, Cabinet and Caucus have authorized with, authorized with my full support that those bills will not move forward this fall. However, there are some budgetary matters that need to be completed to ensure that programs and staff and government have the resources that they need. So we will enter, enter into discussions with the opposition parties to seek a brief legislative sitting this fall to both remove the five bills that were designated for a vote and then to pass the current provincial budgetary matters that need to be resolved. Thank you.